What is up my rose buds and welcome back to the Nava Rose channel. It's your girl Nava Rose and happy BTS tour week. I'm just saying that because they kick off their tour this Saturday in Pasadena and because of that I thought it would be a perfect time to come out with this video. I've been trying to do this video for a while now because I realized that I've never done a BTS inspired clothing haul. I've only done like BTS inspired DIYs or like BTS inspired outfit ideas but I never actually went shopping for BTS inspired clothes. And I think that's such a big thing for my channel because I do fashion. So why haven't I done this video? I did also throw in some black pink outfits because I feel like their style could like match with BTS and stuff. All the clothes, as you guys can see, there's a lot of them. All the clothes are going to be inspired by their outfits, like their personal style, outfits from music videos, or just outfits in general. Okay, so before we jump into this haul, I just want to let you guys know that this video is sponsored by Vanity Planet. And I really want to tell you guys and show you guys all about their Spin for Perfect Skin brush. I figured since we're talking about K-pop, we could also talk about K-beauty a little bit because, you know, Koreans really understand skincare, like to the T. But anyways, I do use a lot of K-beauty products, and with my K-beauty products, I use this brush literally every day. Basically what it is is a facial brush that spins when you hit the button and I use it all the time when I'm washing my face. I especially use it to make sure all the makeup is off like when I'm shooting or when I'm filming. Like I just want to make sure that my pores are clean and that everything is off my face. I've been using this brush for well over six months now and I've noticed that I haven't gotten those really big pimples that I usually always get at least once a month. It's like the big ones that look like volcanoes, you know. Not cute at all. So this one right here attached, sorry if it's dirty, this one one is the exfoliating brush. I'm an exfoliating type of girl so I actually use this one on a daily which is actually what you're supposed to do but and that's because they already have a daily brush so you get a little daily brush then you get a bath brush and then you have a pumice stone brush the spin for perfect skin brush is such an essential to me and I love it so so much and I want you guys to experience the love too so I have an exclusive deal which is 70% off of this brush making the brush $30 which is such a steal because you guys get the brush and all the heads that go with it and to get my discount code all you guys have to do is click the link in my description box and it'll take you right to the website you guys, it's 2019. We gotta get some clear, nice glowing skin. You want such clear, glowing skin that BTS can see you from all the way in the stands, in the audience, and they're like, dang, that girl has radiant skin. Will that ever happen? Maybe not, but you just never know. Okay, that's enough talking, so let's jump into our first BTS and slightly kind of black pink haul. Alright, so let's start this clothing haul. Just want to let you guys know that the lighting is gonna be weird. It's very cloudy today in LA. It's not a typical LA day, so it's gonna get dark, it's gonna get light, it's gonna I'm gonna get blown out. I'm gonna yeah, it's just a mess today. Get it together weather. So the first item that we have is this long sleeve black and red striped top. I actually have this one already in black and white, but I really wanted it in black and red, and I thought it was perfect because Suga and Jimin always wear, or well, I don't know if they wear it nowadays. Their style has evolved a lot, so they don't really wear this that often. I still think it's a nice BTS inspired piece to have. The black and red combo is still seen a lot in their wardrobe and their styling, so yeah. The next piece we have is this plain black turtleneck top, and I noticed that black turtlenecks are seen very frequently in BTS's styling, especially with Jungkook. I feel like he wears this all the time. I already have a black tight turtleneck sweater so I thought that having a loose one would be cute as well. You could either go as Jungkook or Steve Jobs in this outfit right here. So remember guys this is an inspired clothing haul so not everything is going I don't think anything is exactly the same as theirs but it's inspired so it's like kind of sort of like their stuff if that makes sense. RM wears Kingle hats a lot and I've seen my bias V wear a Kingle hat as well but I think they all kind of just wear a lot of berets and Kingle hats in general so really inspired me to get some Kangol hats. I picked up two Kangol hats and I actually grabbed these ones off of Amazon and you know what I actually really really like these versus regular berets I just love the little accent detail and I just think it's cute so thank you BTS for getting me into Kangol hats. Next are these black rim sunnies with orange lenses in them. These are inspired by J-Hope's glasses that he wore in this photo, which obviously, guys, is like the worst screenshot in the world, but this is the best you're going to get because that's the best I could get. It can be borderline 3D glasses looking, you know, but I still like them a lot. I would definitely wear these when I'm not wearing lashes because it's really hard to wear them right now. But I think these are absolutely adorable and I just love the look. Next, we have this plaid flannel and I feel I feel like BTS wears a lot of plaid flannels. Actually, maybe just only Suga wears plaid flannels. The reason why I like this specific flannel is because it's 
really long. It goes up to my knees and it's lightweight. A lot of the flannels that I have in my closet right now are thrifted and they're really, really heavy because they're supposed to be made for keeping you warm. I personally only use them as layering pieces and I just like them as accents. So I love being able to wear this if it's a hot day and I just want, you know, like a nice plaid layering piece over my outfit. So this is perfect. It's nice, cool, and breathy. Breathy? Is that a word? Okay, so moving on, we have this denim jacket that I picked because I love their denim concept photo shoot for their past album for their Love Yourself album and I loved it so much. That is also basically an excuse to get another denim jacket. However, I don't have a denim jacket like this, okay? This one is super, super cropped and I like that it's still oversized. It's kind of hard unless you crop it yourself to find a good denim crop jacket. So I love this one a lot. They have a lot of details, like little button details everywhere. So I thought it was super cute. We love a good denim on denim look, right guys? Now the next item is just these baseline Socks, baseline socks. I meant to just say base socks and I got them because of J-Hope's song Baseline. I absolutely really 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 like that song so I thought it was cool and I like the red stripes. I think I would wear them often. But yeah it's a little shout out to J-Hope right here. We're gonna just do a bunch of accessories right now. So the next accessory is this other beret. There's just so many berets being featured today. So this one is inspired by this photo because I love this photo. It's so adorable and cute. I love the yellow and I love the plaid that Jimin is wearing. So this one is inspired by his outfit. It's a nice yellow suede and it has a cute plaid trim around. I have a thing for yellow plaid trim. So oh my gosh is it? You guys, I didn't even know it was reversible until literally right now. <laughs> Oh my god, I'm terrible. You guys could also have a regular plaid beret. Wow, this is actually really cute. The next piece is this clear bag. J-Hope actually wears a lot of clear bags, so I thought it would be fun to include one in this haul. I actually have my own clear bag. I use it as a side purse, so I'm probably planning to switch all of these into this clear bag. Put just like your random stuff. Don't put your wallet and your phone and your keys because everyone Okay, so moving on to the next item, we got some jewelry. It's not a BTS haul if you don't include jewelry. I absolutely love all the jewelry pieces that they wear. Whoever styles them for jewelry, if it's them or if they have a stylist, oh my gosh. So the first one is obviously this silver ring with chain. This earring is so iconic because a lot of them wear this one. Not exactly this one. They wear a lot of earrings that is just like the ring and then chains hanging down. So I had to pick one up and I definitely wanted to include one in this haul in case you guys don't want to DIY it, which I actually do have a video. If you don't want to do that, then you could always just buy this one for I think a few dollars. Speaking of earrings, I also got this letter stud dangling earring and it just is one letter and it says V because V is my bias. And if V is also your bias, then you guys should get this as well because it's like a nice cute stud, especially if you have multiple piercings. If you guys have two piercings on one end, you could do RM or if you have three BTS. Obviously, you don't want to be spelling like J-Hope's name or Jimin. It's kind of long. But yeah, if you guys want letter earrings that's an idea and of course I had to include taste choker I think it's such a great choker and it looks good on everyone this choker is definitely one of my favorites okay so this next piece is a bow layering t-shirt I just like pairing my t-shirts with long sleeves underneath it actually is not two shirts it's just an attached long sleeve within a shirt and personally I feel it's better that way because you're not overheating in two shirts I know sugar wears a lot of layered tees like this and a lot of the other boys do as well so when I saw this I had to have it and it also has a hand with a rose like my logo so it's basically unintentional merch right here and the next piece is this really nice double-breasted coat and when I was looking at photos of BTS and their fashion I noticed they wear a lot of really nice wool coats and then I thought to myself do I have a really nice coat and I don't so I decided to pick one up for myself this one seems to fit me perfectly the boys wear a lot of oversized really long coats so I wanted to kind of go off of that as well I don't have a nice neutral basic modern coat that I could wear so this one's probably one of my favorites right now next we have this leather jacket for some reason Tay's outfit in this whole V live section has always just been like a favorite of mine so I really liked it I kind of wanted to copy his jacket but I'll be real with you guys it's just a normal leather jacket that he's wearing he's just wearing it a little oversized I don't have an oversized leather jacket but I think it would be nice sometimes to have an oversized leather jacket just to kind of drown in not be so tight and not have it being so fitted I wanted one that 
that was pretty affordable but wasn't too expensive and one that if I wore it quite often and like every day I wouldn't be like oh my gosh I don't want to scratch it I don't want to lose this jacket I don't want to like tear it or anything so and I feel like if you're the same way then I feel like this is a good choice for you guys and last but not least we have this cream fedora and these clear gold glasses with a chain what is this glasses chain I don't even know what it's called and this is straight up inspired by Tay's outfit from their airplane music video I love that look so much I've never tried these chain detail things for your glasses but honestly after today I'm very into it and I feel like I would wear it quite often so yeah these are just two accessories that I pulled from that video that I think I will be wearing quite often now okay so moving on to some black pink stuff I only included it because there's like a few pieces and I felt like it could all like kind of merge together so the first item is this checkered skirt and this outfit is definitely straight up inspired by Jesus outfit from their doo 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 doo, -doo music video when I saw it I just had to include it because it was basically almost the same black pink also wears a lot of checkered in their outfit so I thought this would be a perfect piece in this haul as well and we also have this buckle top which isn't an exact inspired piece from anything that they've worn because it's a little bit more on the sexier side I feel like it's something that they would definitely wear you know maybe in the music video or performance because of the buckles and because of the mesh and just because of the cut in general it looks very black pink as Next are these cargo pants inspired by the ones that Rosé was wearing. I especially like these ones because they had this cute little buckle strap right here. And they also have adjustable buckle straps at the bottom of the leg as well. Very affordable, especially if you're not trying to buy the IMG versions that she was actually wearing. These fit really well at our comfy pair of cargo pants. So if you've been looking for some, here is an option. Alright, so I also picked up these pair of plaid pants. Kind of look like pajamas in a way. I mean, I guess it's the way that you could kind of style it. But these are inspired by these pants that Lisa wore and I know they're not the exact type hers are a little bit more fitted and they have the little cutout right here which I absolutely love those pants and I wish I got those but I think these are also very universal because maybe not everyone wants that cutout right there the plot is pretty similar and they also have a drawstring at the bottom so you guys could cinch at the ankle if you guys are looking for some good statement pants there are some right here lastly I have been so obsessed with their kill this love music video the styling is so on point so I definitely wanted to pick up these pieces this is actually a bikini top. It reminds me of those crop tops that everyone has been wearing, but this time they have buckles as the straps, and I think it's very Kill This Love S. Along with this leg harness, I think this leg harness is really, really cool. I think it's a great accent, especially if you're wearing it with a plain outfit. It just gives off that vibe. I love it so much, so these are probably one of my favorite pieces, and this is why I saved it till the very end. And that concludes my BTS and slightly black pink clothing haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I hope you guys saw some pieces that you liked and might want to add into your guys' closet. Oh, I forgot to mention, I am not unfortunately going to the Pasadena tour this week. I am very sad because BTS will be in my city and I won't even be able to see them. <laughs> But I will be flying to Chicago next week to hang out with all the Chicago people. So I will see you guys then for that tour. For anyone that's going to the tour this weekend, have fun. I'm very jealous of you guys, but I hope you guys have the time of your life and hope you guys meet lots of ARMY. Also, don't forget the discount code for the Spin for Perfect Skin brush is in my description. So go ahead, check that out down below. That is it for this whole video. You guys will be seeing a lot more BTS videos coming up because it's summertime and for some reason I just always do a lot of videos during this time. So I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your week. I love you guys all so freaking very much. Virtual hugs to all of you guys. I love you guys. Bye.